Obviously, they wouldn't want to put someone through a regimen of high vitamin B doses if they had a history of liver problems. You might kill them, and they wouldn't be able to get more money next year from that person. It's all about residual incomes, like any good pyramid. And then he would have been subjected to extended periods of time in a steam room with a high temperature. This explains the question, do you have any history of heart disease? As anybody who's had a heart attack will tell you, they should not be spending too much time in a steam room or engaged in an exercise regimen, even if it's not too strenuous. The combination of these three things can be fatal. Purification is very important. <laughs> and I definitely don't want to neglect the coffee. That way, if you doubt anything I'm telling you, please Google Jean Jacques Pazier. I'll put the uh, spelling of his name right down here somewhere. Uh, or Patrice Vick, I'll put his name up here. At this time, like I was saying earlier, France is one of the few countries with the cajones. I don't know how to say that in French. And if I said it in English, I might have to censor it. Uh, to stand up to the Church of Scientology. Neither the cult agency, which is a uh, ministry under the French Interior Ministry, uh, nor the French IRS under the Ministry of Finance, and the organizations of the French churches, none of these are recognized in France, Scientology as a religion. So they've joined Germany, Denmark, Italy, and many other European countries and firmly rejected Scientology as a religion they treat them as a business, perhaps as it should be. At least while they're behaving in the manner that they're behaving. Scientology is recognized as a religion and does not pay taxes on any of the money that it uses to make frivolous lawsuits and uh, harass people and hire private investigators to send after them. Scientology, of course, denies all of this criticism that I'm making about their purification rundown. They insist that it works, even though they insist that it has no medical benefit. They insist that it also cures many medical conditions, including getting radiation out of your fat cells, uh, which Elron Levitt said uh, radiation was stored in your fat cells and could be expunged by drinking all this vegetable oil and sweating it out. formed their own medical organization uh, called the International Academy of Detoxification Specialists. Now that sounds, sounds like medical speak to me. Sounds like they're claiming to be a medical organization and they claim that this process has medical benefit. They're the ones who made the claim 
that 63% uh, of the rescue workers and, and, and all these people who have inhaled this stuff during September 11th clean up and, and, and search for victims and whatnot, uh, all those real American heroes, uh, this is the organization that makes that claim. No medical, no recognized medical organization makes these claims. It is run by the Church of Scientology, like the Cult Awareness Network. See, all we want them to do, all we want the Church of Scientology to do, is be on a level with us. You know, stop lying to us. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, don't, don't lie to us. Be on a level and sell what works. This French toast is working pretty good. Look at that, beautiful, golden brown. Go ahead and plate the first one up. Start our second batch real quick. A little more butter never hurt. Well, yeah, a little butter never hurt. Many of the things you have to do in Scientology in order to increase this in your spirituality. The purification rundown may need to be repeated at several points in your life. And it's not like buy one, get one free. So you gotta pay for it every time. I'd also like to say thank you to Mark Bunker, uh, Tori Christman, also known as Magoo, who you may have read on Usenet over the years, uh, or you may have seen her videos on, on YouTube or in other places where they surface. I'd also like to say thank you to Stacy Brooks, who's done also a lot to get the word out. Both, both of these people, Tori and Stacy spent a lot of time in Scientology, and uh, they know what they're talking about. So get out there and see, watch their videos. And uh, Mark Bunker is the wise beard man from Zenu TV. So check him out on YouTube or or ZenuTV.com. I'll put those addresses somewhere around here. Uh, and if you want to know more about Vic, Patrice Vic. Be sure to check out whyarethedead.net. Uh, whyarethedead.net. I'll tell you all about him and uh, many other people who died in suspicious circumstances in the Church of Scientology's care. We've got our second batch almost ready here. I'll plate this up. Very nice. 